boys and girls, for this lesson, all you need today is your dry erase board and your Expo marker. Hi boys and girls, welcome back. Today for shared reading, we are going to read Dad is at Work. It's a book about all the different jobs dads can have. Let's take a picture walk, like Spinner the Spider here, and find out what kind of jobs dads can have. All right, let's take our picture walk. The name or the title of our story is Dad is at work. Let's look at the pictures and see what kind of jobs these dads do. Here's the title page, Dad is at work. In this picture, it looks like this dad's a firefighter. I know a few firefighters. That's a cool job. This dad looks like a doctor. I see a white coat and a stethoscope. Oh, this dad, he looks like a dentist. I see the mask right there to go over his mouth. This dad is a carpenter. He looks like some of the guys I see around my, around my house building houses. This dad is a teacher. I can see him helping kids. Oh, and this dad is a dad hugging his daughter. All right, now that we've taken a picture walk and gotten an idea about the story, let's go back and read it together. I'll point at the words you read along with me. Here we go. Dad is at work. Great job. Read the title with me one more time. Dad is at work. Remember, good readers point at the words when they're starting out. My dad is a firefighter. My dad is a doctor. My dad is a dentist. My dad is a carpenter. Now boys and girls, I knew that this word was carpenter and not builder because b, -b builder would start with a B. And carpenter starts with that magic C we've talked about that says k. So I knew it was carpenter. As I read, I do that. I look at that beginning sound. You should too. My dad is a teacher. My dad is a dad. Super reading, boys and girls. What do you think you want to be when you grow up? Think about it. Would you want to be a teacher? Do you want to be a dentist? Tell me. What do you think you would like to be? Great job reading. Hi boys and girls. I need your help to play a matching game. Do you think you could help me? You're super smart, I know you can. I have some capital letters and I need to match their lowercase letters or their small letters. So I have capital A or big A, capital C, capital D, capital L, capital O, and capital T. Down below in blue, I have some lowercase letters. I need your help to find the ones that go together. So, first up, here's capital A. Do you see lowercase a down here? Point to it on the screen. You got it, it's this one. A says a like alligator or apple. I'll put them together. So now there's capital A and lowercase a. All right, next up, one of my faves, C. 
Here's capital C. C says k, like in cat. Do you see lowercase c in the blue? I knew you would. Look at you. You know magic C. That one's easy peasy, lemon squeezy. We'll put it right with capital C. So capital C, lowercase c. Next up, capital D. Do you see lowercase d in the blue? Point to it on your screen. You got it, smart stuff. There it is, lowercase d. So we'll match those up right there. Capital D, lowercase d. D says d, like in dog. Next up, capital L. L says ol. We learned how to make lucky L in our last lesson. Do you see lowercase l down here? It's one of the easiest ones to make. You got it, it's right there. You just go straight down to make an L. I'll match them up. So now we have capital L and lowercase l. Next one, capital O. Do you see lowercase o down here? Point to it. Yeah, you got it. It just looks like a mini me. Capital O, lowercase o. Twinsies. Last one, capital T. Do you see lowercase t? It's the only guy left. Here he is. You got it, T says T. So now we have capital T and lowercase t. Great job, boys and girls. You can keep trying this at home, matching up any letters that you have. All right, now it's time for letter formation. Last time you learned how to make lucky L, and I said if you could make lucky L, you can make some other letters. Let me show you how. Remember, when you made L, you just went straight down, starting at the top, like that, easy peasy. So today I'm gonna to teach you how to make T. So get out your Excel marker and your whiteboard if you have one. If you don't, just get out a piece of paper and a marker and let's try it together. So to make T that says T, you're gonna make an L first, start at the top, go straight down, and then you're just gonna cross like that. Perfect, you make a T. Let's try another one. Start at the top, go straight down like an L, and then cross like that. And looky here, now you can make a T. Practice that at home. Hi boys and girls, we're gonna do a picture sort and all of our pictures are either gonna start with the letter K that says K or the letter L that says O. Will you help me? All right, our first picture is lock. O, O lock. Where will I put it? You guessed it, with the letter L, lock. Oh, here's a cute kitten. Kitten starts with a k sound. Where will I put it? You guessed it, with the k's. Oh, I love this fruit. It's one of my favorite fruits. Lemon, oh, oh, lemon. Yep, with the l's. Oh, look at this cute ladybug. Ladybug, what does ladybug start with? You got it, letter L. L for ladybug. I bet you know what this is. It's a picture of a key. K, k, key. Where will I put it? You guessed it, letter K. Here's a picture of a lamp. Oh, lamp. Where will I put it? You guessed it, letter L. L is for lamp. Here's a picture of a king. K, k, king. Where will it go? Very good, goes with the K's. K, king. Oh, look at this cute kangaroo. K, k, kangaroo. Where will it go? You guessed it, letter K. K for kangaroo. Oh, here's a picture of a ladder. Oh, ladder. Where will it go? You guys are so smart. Of course, it goes with the letter L. And our last picture, boys and girls, is a picture of a koala. K, koala. Where will that go? So smart. Letter K for koala. Great job, boys and girls. All right, boys and girls, it's homework time. All right, you need to get out your magnetic letters and get out all the letters in your name. 
I have all of the letters that make up my special unique name. And remember, boys and girls, your name is the most important name you're going to learn to read and write in kindergarten. I'm so excited for you. All right, I have the letters out that are unique to my name. Are you ready? I'm going to mix them up and you know this is my favorite part. All right, putting it back together. S, T, oh, and there's that T that you learned to make. I love that T. A, C, and Y. Boys and girls, there's the letters to my name. Have fun with your homework.